Hello and welcome to another minion guide. Today we're looking at the wind up Susano minion. This pet is obtained from crafting with the crafting item the Blade of Revelry, which drops rarely from Susano himself on extreme mode difficulty of that primal. This crafting item can actually be made into three different items, a Susano miniature for your house with 70 armor, barding for chocobos again with level 70 armor, and in our video's case, level 70 weaving. The minion itself is pretty cool with low interaction rates to emote actions, however his idle animation is a downward slash with his blade of revelry, which is pretty cool. He hovers over the floor as you move, and his feathered helm flutters in the wind as he does so. His minion text to summon him reads, Summon your wind-up Susano minion. If the Kojin believe that within every item resides a deity, then who exactly resides inside this automaton? A good question, to be honest. His main summon guide text reads, With an itsy Yata no Kagami in his left hand and a bitsy Ame no Murakumo in his right, one might almost forget his miniature Magatama throbbing wildly in this Lilliputin lord of the Revel's breast. Almost. This pet can go anywhere from 200 to 800k on my server. You'll need to check yours. Likely it will be very different. All in all, this is a great little addition to our collection and one to set aside miniature Lakshmi as a testament to very enjoyable extreme primal design for the entry of Stormblood. Hopefully they continue this and we see some more challenging fights. If you enjoyed this video, there are countless other minion guides made and being made for Stormblood on my channel for you to subscribe to to get notifications on the latest when it goes live. Thank you kindly for watching and I'll see you next time.